in those actions by the government agents one of the issues that will be looking into in this case is the question of entrapment or as it is more commonly known the actions of a person as directed by government agents or actions instigated by agents the affidavit that the government released revealed in the affidavit in the government's own words that the government provided money the government was involved in transportation the government was involved in meetings at which various things were discussed one of the issues that mr. Sadie raised in the court appearance that was just concluded involved the fact that at one of the very early meetings in the case the affidavit says that the recording equipment failed and there will be questions raised about that as there were raised in the in the courtroom keep in mind please that we are at the very beginning of what is likely to be a long process the invest defense investigation of this matter is just getting underway there is a lot to inquire into and we are confident that everyone will keep in mind that this is a process in which it is critical for people to keep an open mind and to understand that we are at the beginning of the process and not to prejudge those matters which are put out there as allegations and those matters which are put out as allegations that contain within themselves the seed of areas that must be inquired into entrapment and as mr. Sadie indicated in the courtroom the timing of the arrest why things waited until that point we are not in a position in which we can answer questions mr. Sadie and one of the investigators from the office miss Hamilton have spent a great deal of the weekend working with mr. Muhammad and getting to know him and his family and as things unfold from here on out they will be unfolding in all likelihood in the courtroom through court proceedings and in court papers there's not much that we can say beyond that and we thank you for your interest there is not much more we can say beyond what I have already said I'm sorry what about mr. Holton statements that even when he was told women and children would die he still wanted to do this do you have any response to that there is no more that we can comment on in terms of the specifics we as I said are at the very beginning the information that was released in this complaint is information that says that there was a tremendous amount of government involvement precisely who was saying what to whom under what circumstances what the meaning of it was will be revealed as the case unfolds when's the thank you court date the next court date is not yet firmly set the court set a tentative trial date of February 1st whether or not that is the date on which the case goes to trial will be determined as the weeks go by you did say that you meant by the timing the last issue you just raised was the timing of the arrest and by that you mean why they waited so long just to clarify there there are undoubtedly questions that will be raised about the timing of the arrest why they waited so long the impact that that delay had on the ability to get a fair trial and what if anything it says about the process of the investigation and those are issues that I'm sure we will be looking into thank you thank you counsel the case just argued will be submitted for decision